is of a real contender. Well, there's absolutely no doubt that she has great wit and she's got phenomenal comic timing, which we've seen and will see. Um, the thing about it is, is, has she actually got the vocal security to be able to do it? And look, sometime in the living was a little difficult, wasn't it, last week? And I um, chose maybe this time because this is a diva's number. We must again see whether she can keep herself in tune and keep herself on track. Fingers crossed. Let's see whether she can put all she's learned over the past weeks into practice. It's Tomboy Maria Abbey! <laughs> Desperate to achieve her lifelong ambition to become the world's first singing Jewish nun, here's Abby! Maybe this time I'll be lucky Maybe this time he'll stay Maybe this time for the first time, love won't hurry away. He will hold me fast. I'll be home at last. Not a loser anymore, like the last time and the time before Everybody Loves a winner So nobody loves me Lady peaceful Lady happy That's what I long to be Remember, all the phone lines are open. You can pick up the phone and vote for your favourite Maria. Uh, now, Abby, you always have so much support in the house. Yeah. <laughs> I'm very, very lucky. I have the most wonderful friends and family any girl could wish for. I'm the luckiest person. I really am. And what about, I mean, going in your daily life? Are people recognising you? Um, yeah, I had a funny incident on the tube. Uh, this woman came up to me and said, are you that Abby from How Do You Solve a Problem Like Maria? And I said, yes. She goes, I didn't vote for you. <laughs> but you're doing very well, so thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. OK. <laughs> you owe her now. Pick up the phone. Go on. Uh, John, uh, Abby's come and gone for you. One yeah. day a leading lady, the yeah. other day someone in the chorus. Now, if you just look back at what you just did, Abby, and that humour and that pizzazz you had when you were talking to Graham, I so wish that you brought some of that to the number. For me, it's about consistency. And over the last couple of weeks, you've been inconsistent because one, like when we give you big numbers like this, you sell it, sell it, sell it. But when we give you something else, you don't really sell it. I am worried that that inconsistency will be your downfall. Don't worry. Okay? <laughs> don't worry. Right. I can do it. Okay, Abby's not worried. Uh, you are. How's Zoe? Are you worried? Um, I'm not worried vocally for Abby. That was a safe song for Abby. That's what she does best. She goes out, she gives a big belty performance. She's happy. She makes everybody else happy. <laughs> Hang on. But, but, hello. I'm but. finished. <laughs> <laughs> Big but. No, there are areas of your voice which you know I get uncomfortable about and I get scared for you. Um, yeah. Just that straining slightly. Yeah. You, do, you, you do tend to crack. But um, I think you've got a great career in musical theatre. Do I think you're Maria? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. David, David, if Abby's in the final three, are you relaxed about it? Uh, no. Big spender two weeks ago, fabulous, summertime, terrible, tonight, pretty good, belty song, you do it well. Inconsistency is our enemy in musical theatre. Maria's got to be fantastic for me, Monday to Saturday, not part-time. Sorry. And Andrew, 
What do you think about her <laughs> consistency? Well, this is the problem. I mean, you've got to be a cast iron singer to be able to do the role of Maria. I mean, what is completely without any question, and I take John on this is completely, is, is that the wit and the, the, the humour that you have and the way you answer back and the fact, and you said you're Jewish and all of that, and it's very great. I mean, you have that, um, that, that, that great charm. Uh, and there is definitely a role for you. You know, I mean, if I were casting Funny Girl yes. or something like that, yeah. I would say I you would be. Well, there you go. But can she, Andrew? Can she? I, be uh, I, I'm not sure about Maria. I really am not. Um, but I do think that you will have a major career in musical theatre, and I think particularly when you get the security in your voice, you, you sort of recovered hugely in that because you did go a little bit off key but you did you did really well tonight Thank you. i'm just not sure that maria is actually the role but there is definitely a part for you i mean it's sort of out there um I, funny girl i think it's rather a good idea should Let's we do it right. Let's, should we do it all right. Let's get the right all right who cares what andrew and the panel think it's ultimately up to you to decide do you decide who gets to play maria von trapp to keep Abby in the running, call 090 211 Or text vote Abby to 87222. Fingers crossed.